Hi all, welcome to the channel, welcome to the world, it's the world away, and we now got part 59 of Hashit Partworks Build the Terminator. <laughs> Okay, in this issue, we're going to be doing a muscle for the right fire. There's not a lot to do in this issue, but we are going to need our glue and we're also going to need our screwdriver. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, there is one thing that I want to query in this issue, and I'll show you that when I come to it. So as you can see, this is everything that we've got in this issue, and I'll just show you there on the close-up as well. The actual large area here is metal, just so you know. It's not plastic. So uh, obviously that part's a support part there. Um, that's actually called the right leg joint. <laughs> that's all they're labelling that. Uh, we're going to be gluing the uh, detail here into the joint then we're going to be doing working on the tendon which requires another little bit of glue just onto the end there and we're going to secure that in this is the bit that i'm a bit confused about we've got this section that we worked on last time and it says make sure you've got the right one and if you can see there it's got a number one inside it there well i've checked the other one that i've got of these as well and that's also got a number one in there i don't know if one's meant to have one or two or they've sent me the wrong part so uh, let me know in the comments if your other one's got a number two in there, if that's the case, it means I've got the wrong bit there. But uh, I've got two number ones just for this bit here. So uh, might be worth just checking yours on that one. Uh, and then obviously we're going to affix this to Termi, who's lying over here looking uh, in a bit of a state at the moment. Uh, screw that in and that's all there is to do in that issue. Now in the next issue, as you can see, we're going to be assembling more muscles, pretty much similar looks like to what we've just done in this issue. So that's going to be pretty repetitive into issue 60. Uh, that should be coming. Hmm, not next week, the week after, because at the moment it's every two weeks at the moment, but we are waiting patiently to see when this schedule uh, changes and goes back to regular schedule. But uh, I hope you're all keeping safe out there. Without further ado, let's get cracking. So the first thing I'm going to do is we're going to be putting this little ratchet here into the three lugs there. As you can see, you've got three lugs at the bottom there. All they're going to do is they're going to fit in just like that, just making sure that the lugs actually go into the holes so you shouldn't be able to rotate it round. Uh, but this is going to need some glue. So I've got my trusty super glue here. And all I'm going to do, just drop some in there like that. And then use my pin vise with a pin attached to it, which again is available on the Amazon store, just to dab that in there like that. And then just put that in the insides of this here. Now being metal, obviously you want to use super glue on this. Because you don't want this coming out. And that's number three there. It's going to go a little bit more just onto the points on top. It doesn't say put them on top, but uh, again, I don't want this little ratchet falling out. There we go. That should be perfect. Line it up again. And just make sure that's in nice and straight. There we go. Looking just like that. Now we've got a tiny, tiny little tendon ring looking like that. Now one side has got a small circle. One side's got a larger circle. It's the larger circle that's going to go into the ends just here. Now this will be held in with a screw, but they also want us to glue it as well. So I'm just going to put some glue just around the edge of this. Uh, once again, exactly the same way that we just did there. Just around the edge here. I'm not using too much glue on this because I said this is going to be held in with a screw. And a little bit of that. Perfect. Make sure it goes in the right way. And that's just going to fit on just like that. Then we're going to grab one of these flange screws here, which is a PWB 2 times 5 mil, And that, as I said, is just going to secure this into place. So we put this into this side here, just like that, and secure that down. Nice and tight. So you see that's going absolutely nowhere. Now we don't need this part now. That could just go to one side and we've got to bring over the Terminator. So I've just lined it up where we're going to be actually working. We're going to be working on this area here next to uh, the phi uh, plate here that we just put in last time. Uh, because this is actually going to be fitting into this section here. Now, this has got two sides you can put in. You've got indent side and you've got a straight side there. The straight side goes towards the centre of the model. So this is going to be going in this way, just like that. So the straight side here is facing this side. So I'm going to hold that in place and we're going to secure it in with one of these uh, screws, which is a PM 3 times 16 mil screw. So it's just going to go into this side here, just like that, through each, and then screw to the other side. Should be a nice tight fit. Just like that, I'm not over tightening it. And there we go, we've got another tendon in place. And that's all there is to do in that issue. So we've attached that, we've got the joint, which they don't want us to put in yet. 
And then we've got this tendon here, which once again, they don't want us to put in yet, but yep, that's all there is to do. See what I mean about being quick? It is nice to have a little bit of metal in this issue, that's for sure, but uh, I said it is gonna take uh, a little while before issue 60 comes. Um, Matthew Thomas, one of my patrons actually, he posted some pictures on the uh, Build the Terminator website, the Facebook page, and the link's in the description for that, of issues 66 and 67, so not sure how you managed to get hold of them, Matthew, but uh, very interesting, looks like we've got some feet work going on there. But that's all there is, so uh, I really hope if you like that video if you did please remember to give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already please remember to subscribe other than that take care